Hello everyone, it's Yvette with Polished After 60. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. So it's sweater weather here in Florida. Um, normally in January and February, sometimes a little bit in December, we're able to pull out our sweaters and wear them. So I thought I'd show you today some of um, my outfits um, that I would be wearing if I were going out. So hold on just a moment. All right, guys, I'm back. So in this first look, I wanted to show you, um, sometimes we can get really nice sweaters with some um, pretty details. And this sweater, it's um, kind of an orange colored sweater, and it has a little bit of a gold detail at the buckle, at the neckline, so I like that a lot. And I actually paired this um, sweater with a pair of um, aubergine colored um, pants by um, Susan Graver and a pair of animal print um, booties. So I think it's a very cute look. And um, guys, if you're new to my channel and you're here for the very first time, welcome. This channel is all about um, styling and beauty, fashion, just a little bit of everything for the more mature woman. So if you think you'd be interested, please consider subscribing to my channel. So, um, I have pulled out a collection of my sweaters. Um, as I said, we don't get to use them a lot for a couple of months, usually in January and in February. We have had some cool weather. It went down into the 30s, and I think the high for today is going to be 60. So this would absolutely be an outfit that I would wear if I were going out, right? Um, we're still locked up in our houses and you know we have to be extra careful and vigilant um, so that we're able to get our vaccines and um, hopefully get back to normal real soon. So hold on a second, I have a few more looks for you. Hold on. Oh gosh, guys. So I did wanna mention something to you guys um, that kind of horrified me actually. Uh, a few videos ago, I received a question from um, one of you lovely ladies. And guys, thank you for your comments. Virginia, I'm appreciating all the support that you're sending me, so thank you. But I did receive a question from someone on one of the outfits that I was wearing. And all of the uh, filming that I'm doing is from my camera. Okay, guys? Um, I'm not yet sophisticated enough to have a video recorder, so everything that I'm doing is coming from my camera, so it's quite small. And um, I was asked a question, so I pulled it up on my tablet, all right? And I was a little bit horrified. Now, if you ladies have seen my Foundation Friday video, you know that I dislike wearing bras very much, all right? I'll just come right out and say it, all right? Um, so I normally wear comfort bras, and whatever bra I was wearing that day was just horrible. It did nothing for me, all right? So I started to pull out some of my bras and, you know, go through them and put them on, and, you know, those underwire things just kill me. All right, they give me a headache right away. I have been fitted for bras before, so I know it's not the fit. It's just that I don't like them. So I went on the hunt um, for some comfort bras that give a little bit of lift. And ladies, oh my goodness, what a difference it makes, right? To have our, our breasts lifted and um, it just gives us a better look. So, um, I hope you agree that this is a little bit better. Now, I don't know if you can tell um, with me wearing this sweater, but we need to be careful uh, with those things, right? I just put on, you know, some of the bras that I was used to wearing, and then when I took a, 
third look, right, um, I realized that um, my breasts were not where they should have been, all right? So that's not a look that we want, ladies, right? So I thought I, I would share that with you. We all know, right? We all know, but sometimes we're so comfortable that we don't, we overlook the obvious. So I just wanted to mention my experience and um, help prevent um, something like that from happening to you guys, all right? So anyway, ladies, um, I'll be back. All right, ladies, so here is another one of those sweaters which um, you need to find underpinnings for, right? So this is a beautiful sweater um, in navy and this royal blue, which I think is just beautiful, but um, the cabling on it is quite large. You can, see, you can see it on the sleeve of the sweater, right? So you have to make sure that you wear something appropriate underneath. But once you've done that, I think it's quite, it's, is just a beautiful sweater. I really like it. Um, this one I can wear a little bit more often because it's not quite as heavy as some of the others that I've shown you um, in this video, but I like this sweater very much. Sometimes I wear it with leggings and sometimes I'll wear it with jeans. So it's quite versatile. The colors are beautiful. And um, all right, let's see what else I have for you guys. Hold on. All right, guys, so this is a much more casual look. Uh, this is a striped sweater, and very, the colors are very autumnal, right? So orange and brown and camel. It does have a little bit of blue, and I just paired it with a pair of boot-cut jeans and a pair of um, camel-colored flats to pick up on the camel of the sweater, right? So these are items that for me, I don't hardly ever get to wear. Uh, we may have, you know, just a handful of cold days here in Florida, but it's nice to have them in our collection for those chilly days when we need to go out to run an errand or go out for more special things. And um, it's good to have them in our collection, right? So hold on guys, hold on. All right, ladies, so this will be the um, final look for today. And I have, um, I have styled all these sweaters very casually because I think that right now that's the way we're living, right? Um, we may go out, but um, most, of, most of the time we're um, going out for casual occasions. Now, this is the Karen Scott sweater that I purchased um, from Zulily. Uh, you can see that it has a little bit of beading, uh, little silver beads, um, and it has cable, uh, cables, um, knitting going through it, and a mock turtleneck, all right, or a mock collar. And I have just paired it with a pair of jeans and a pair of sneakers. Now, I can absolutely see this um, sweater paired with a black pencil skirt. I think that would be beautiful. Um, and some boots. Um, so there's many ways that we can style this, right? But for today's video, I thought that we would um, look at more casual options um, that we might wear. Now, I know that some of you ladies are not yet retired and do work um, and are in the office. So I will try to um, upload a video with more uh, business looks for you, okay? Because, you know, some of us are still working, right? Um, so anyway, ladies, this is it for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. I did want to mention one thing. I normally use um, the Philosophy gels to shower with, and I recently saw a, an Olay product, um, a bath, bath, um, bath, lotion or bath gel um, that has hyaluronic acid in it and I thought well let me give it a try. Ladies, it's beautiful. It's just lovely. It's by Olay. It has hyaluronic acid in it and that's anti-aging so we might as well anti-age our bodies as well. I could not believe how lovely it was. I mean, I, I'm constantly uh, rubbing my arms and my legs because they just feel so smooth and soft to the touch. So it's very moisturizing. I thought I'd mention it to you guys in case you're interested. Ladies, thank you again 
for all your beautiful support and all your comments. I appreciate it so much. Um, I'll be uploading another video real soon. See you then. Bye. Have a wonderful day.